Hey guys, this is Tina from Rata here and welcome back to some more Let's Play Tomb Raider 3. This is part 2 of Elvich, the hopefully last part. And yeah, I still have that awesome time puzzle to do with those two buttons. Uh, I would say let's go and give it a try then. Uh, ah, just don't, yeah, just don't run into walls, Lara. Oh, that sucks. The timer on those doors is actually pretty strict. There are not a lot of mistakes allowed, so yeah, just wait until the door is closed again and try it again. Ooh. Of course, Lara, yes, yes, of course, thank you. Maybe, maybe I'll make it anyway. Come on. Ah, holy crap. <laughs> That was a close one, <laughs> but I made it, thank god. <clears throat> yeah, it is actually, I think it is recommended to use sprinting on um, on the straight, on a straight path and not around the corner like, yeah, I tried before. You, you can see what happens, unless you're a very skilled Tomb Raider player, so yeah, <laughs> like I said, I'm not, so. Okay, that was door number one. Let's try door number two. Uh, door number two actually also opens together with the right button. And, uh, of course, yes, yes, of course. Whoa, 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 come on, Lara. <gasps> Holy crap, okay. Wow, door number two. I think if I would have ran into a wall twice, I would have have run back and yeah, tried it again. I actually don't know how many seconds the doors are open, but yeah, like I said, Lara needs to her needs to move her skinny ass as fast as she can. Hey, my ass is not skinny; it's like perfectly proportioned. Psst, Lara. Oh, and I might need to heal. I think. Why, why is my health so low? I don't even remember why. <laughs> uh. I'm sorry. Okay. Oh, uh, and this timer. Ah, okay. This timer is actually very, very short. You need to hurry up as hell right here. Okay, let's try this again. Go on, Lara. Don't. Ah. Uh. Stop bumping into walls all the time. You annoy the crap out of me, seriously. Let's try it again. Uh, yes, yes, of course. Thank you for that, Lara. That was like... That was like the cherry on top of the whipped cream. <laughs> Whatever. And now, come on, come on, come on, come on. Just don't run into any corners. Woo, yeah, boy. Wow, made it. Thank God. I think this is actually the only timed puzzle in uh, in this level. <clears throat> Not in the Tomb, Ra Tomb Raider game. Uh, in this Tomb Raider game, I mean. I bet there are going to be a lot of... Uh, there are going to be more and more of those fine time puzzles for us to solve. Uh, oh, joy. <laughs> Okie dokie. After grabbing the, the shotgun and the uh, safe crystal, I just grabbed another key. And yeah, we actually needed to collect two keys. And uh, it's actually really dark. Uh. I'm sorry. I can see that well. <laughs> Let's use a flare. I actually think um, that... No, what did I want to say? Oh, Tina, why do you always keep forgetting what you wanted to say? Your brain really sucks. I'm glad I don't have it. Shut up, Lara. Yeah, what I wanted to say, you will see soon what we need those two keys for. There you go, Lara. I didn't forget it. Er. Okay, and yeah, since I have a lot of shots in this gun, let's use the MP5. Come on. Jeff. Uh, did you drop anything? Hmm, you didn't. Yeah, you didn't. You're, 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 you're a bastard. Okay, Lara, now get to know something that the normal London commuter does every day. Oh, what is it? You use this old penny, throw it into this ticket machine. 
Oh, are we gonna get more money now? No, it's a ticket. Oh, fun. I bet you have never bought one in your life, Lara. No, actually I haven't. Why would I? I explained it to you in the last episode. Yeah, you did. And I just ran into the wrong direction and into a lantern. That's why I don't like places like this. Yeah, because you get stuck all the time. Stop, get, stop getting stuck all the time, Lara, I think. You've already done it enough. <laughs> Come on. Psst, psst, psst. Chess. I could see your flare. Okay. Did you drop anything out of ma'am? Anything interesting? Oh, no, you didn't. Okay. Okay, guys. Um, time to grab the uh, the pistols. Uh, I want to show you the location of the. I think it's a third. Yeah, of the third secret. It is like right down here. Ah. It's really dark, so I had to use my, the pistols as flares. <laughs> Okay, how do I get out of here? Uh, oh, I think here. Yeah. Here. Ah, uh, come on, Lara. Line up properly, please. Okay. Yep. Um, and now... Um, 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 um... Yeah, yeah. Now it's actually time to go for... Um, yeah, a pretty difficult part of the game. Oh, what is she aiming at? Oh, it's... Ah! Come on! It's mice. <laughs> Numbing on Lara's black boots. They actually cost a lot of money. They better... They better not be ruined now! Kill this ba bastard right here and... Um... Yeah. By pressing that switch right here... We open both doors. There are actually, yeah, there are two doors that were, that were closed. You will see in a second. And I think you don't have to be afraid of the, of the tube right here. Oh. What, was there something in the corner? Wait, hold on a second. Is there... I can't see anything at all. Well, when I press the action button, Lara actually, actually doesn't react, but... Oh, well, okay. Okay, guys. Fun joy part of the game is coming up. Um, yeah, we get to enter a maze and I think it would be a good idea to save right now and I also have like a little drawing that I got from uh, from Stella's website next to me that will hopefully help me through this and I will just take a look on it for a second. Hold on guys. Okay, I think I think I got it. At least I hope I got it. Okay, this is switch A. Press this one and... Go to the right, press switch B. You actually have to be careful. There are about, I think, six or so switches and you can some of them you must not press. I don't know why it's not explained um, in Stella's walkthrough, but yeah, I think I, I actually don't want to test it. <laughs> so yeah, um, wait, I'm confused. <laughs> Just another peek on the drawing again, sorry. Um, uh. Ah, yeah. The door right here is opened. Um, press the left one, not the right one. Ignore the right switch. I don't know what it does. Like I mentioned before. <laughs> and don't forget the map pack in the, that is like hidden in the very dark right here. Okay. Um, and now I think we have to run back and press switch B again. Why ever? Uh, such stuff doesn't make any sense to me anyway. Ha, huh, yeah. This is the door that we needed to open and there are also some goodies somewhere around here. Uh, yep, yeah, we have to go down here actually. Oh god. This, this is, this is confusing as hell, but yeah. At least, uh, at least I didn't, didn't get lost or something like that. But yeah, I really ask myself, how can you solve something like that? Without a guide, I mean, how would you know that you're not allowed to press this, these switches or, yeah, some of these switches and how, how do you know in which order you have to press them? This is, I don't know. Anyway, welcome to the Masonic Temple, guys. Um, a really weird place um, of whatever. <laughs> I would say let's just 
use the key Salamus key and I think Salomon's key. There are two different keys. Okay. And here we place the second one. Go on there, hurry up. Yes. Okay, and that opens this door over there. Um Yeah, don't forget the goodies that are like around here. There's some ammo and uh, also a safe crystal like right over here. And actually now I'm gonna get a, go and grab a an item that we need to get the fourth C uh, the fifth C no wait. The third secret. That before was the second, but uh Lara somehow didn't grab it, but maybe it appears after I've grabbed the item out of here. I don't know. Let's just go. This is actually the mel. What's what's it called again? Yeah, it's just a hammer. I, I forgot it. Um, doggy, doggy time. Come on. Woo. Okay, and now I actually really ask myself if the star is a... It is an... Yeah, it is actually an ornate star that we want to grab, but... Where the hell is it? Don't tell me that my game is glitching or something like that. Don't tell me that my game is glitching. Ha have I done something wrong or something like that to make it appear or... Uh, I'm confused. It I'm actually pretty sure that it is this hole right here, but there are also there are all, uh, other holes that you can drop through, but I'm confused right now. Hold on a sec. Uh. I could have sworn it is down here, seriously. Lara, you damn slack. Why? Where the hell is the ornate star? I I I am al I'm almost about to say that let's screw the, the third secret because yeah I don't know there's a, there seems to be something wrong about about the the copy of this game or am I just mad? Yeah, that there are really no other tiles that you can break through and. Oh, I'm so confused. Oh. I know you can't drop down the others because there are like spikes down there. I'm pretty sure, but <laughs> I'm I'm I think I'm, I'm I'm crazy or something like that. Hmm. Hmm. <sighs> okay, you know what? I think. I don't want to bore you any more with this. Uh, <laughs> looks like I couldn't get the ornate star there. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, I'm. am sorry about that, guys. I'm really sorry. But yeah, I would say I, I I continue with the game and yeah, maybe I can add a little note later on or something like that, if I figured out what exactly went wrong right there. But. Uh. <laughs> Oh, great. It's more sewer water. Okay, I, I guess I'm gonna use another flare. <laughs> oh, my neck aches as hell. Okay. Oh, it's really dark down here. Come on. Stop getting stuck all the time. That's actually something that I really hate in this game, that, that they like, get stuck at, wall, uh, at walls and doors and stuff like that. It's uh, pretty annoying. Lara, yeah, you see? Now, now she got stuck at the door. Woo! Okay. Whoa, that's actually really light. Holy crap. Ah, go away. Ah, flare, you hurt my eyes. <laughs> okay, uh, that room up there. If we, if we would have been able to grab the ornate star, we would have came, came, uh, come out of this door right there. But yeah. Didn't seem to work, so... Oh, th really? Th this is really annoying me right now. I'm I'm trying to figure out what exactly I did wrong right there. Ah, uh, it's annoying. 
Because actually, yeah, like as you know, I want to get all secrets in, in this let's play, so yeah, it, it would actually kind of annoy me if I wouldn't get all of them. Hmm. Oh, anyway, Lara, now let's experience something new. The use of a ticket. Oh, wow. It's that easy. And now? Oh, the doors have opened themselves. I should actually add something like that to my to my door so everyone has to pay you know every person has to pay once to enter my house uh, wow you sound like a re very nice guest host Lara <laughs> of course I am uh, uh, drop have you dropped something oh yeah you have it's it's a map pack and what the hell is a fire doing in there <laughs> Yeah, if we would have gotten the ornate star, we would have... Uh, what the... What the hell? Now you also won't let me... Oh, yeah. You. Oh my gosh, I thought something is terribly wrong right there. But Yeah, if we would have gotten the ornate star, we could have entered right here and grabbed the third secret. But... Uh, no, Lara, don't use it. Um. Okay, you know what? This is really annoying me. I will try to figure out what exactly I've done wrong. I'll stop the recording for a second. Or yeah, at least a few minutes. And yeah, then I'll be back. I have figured out what I've done wrong, guys. You know what you have to do? You have to roll behind this curtain right here. And ta-da! There it is. The ornate star. Oh my god. I'm such a dumbass. Seriously. <laughs> it would have been so easy, but... Yeah, guess I tried too hard. <laughs> okay, then, then let's get back now and I will actually see you back where the ticket thing is. So, welcome back. I'm actually really glad that I figured this whole thing out. <laughs> let's go and grab the secret then, I would say. <sighs> okay, use the Ornith star right here. Yeah. That's how we like it. Um, uh, I think this room, or at least this secret, actually contains one safe crystal. So yeah, I think it is worth it. It was worth backtracking and grabbing it. <laughs> uh, come on, Larry, hurry up! Such a lame ass. So, um, I don't trust it. Ah, yeah. And have you heard that squee squeaking door sound? This is actually a door I've showed you um, before. And wait, where is this lead? I somehow don't trust this. Let's better <laughs> run back here. Yeah, and this is the room we have where we have been before. I guess you remember it. Okay, let's try it. Uh, ah! Oh, no, Larry, you're such a stupid bastard. <laughs> but I think she has behaved very well until now today, so yeah. I think I can, whoops, I think I can bear with her until the, the end of the level today. We're actually very, very close already. Très, très, whatever. I don't even know what close in French means. Okay. And oh no, <laughs> my laptop, my lap, my laptop. <laughs> My laptop is starting to be noisy, actually. I hate that. Shut up, laptop. Shut up, shut up, shut up. Um, and, uh, not down here yet. Yeah, right here we actually have to place the... What's it called? Masonic... Masonic something. Ah, Why have I forgotten it? It was, um, it was in my mind all the time before, but... I've forgotten it. I'm, I'm really sorry about that. <laughs> okay. Now we have opened the door somewhere and up there, if I wouldn't have missed it, 
up there is actually Woo, come on. It's the fourth secret. Boom. Oh, Lara, come on. <laughs> Grab it. Okay. Sorry if I'm a bit quiet, but I'm trying to remember which way I have to run because I'm pretty confused right now. I'm playing this level. Well, I'm not playing it blind, but this is like my first time playthrough. I've just playing, yeah, with the memory. I've watched a walkthrough of this, but yeah, I'm just playing, yeah, out, out of my mind, how, however you say that. Uh, so, yeah. My, how can I say? <coughs> yeah, just like that. Okay. Um. Oh, yeah, there's like a hobo down here. <laughs> Yes, something that is really interesting actually. Die first! Okay. Something that is really interesting actually, as uh, someone, I think, yeah, it was Bob the Pet Ferret, he actually told me in the comment section of the first Elvich part that um, the Elvich station does exist. It, it isn't used anymore for like public transport and everything, but they actually use it like. Oh bats okay they actually use it um for films like for film sets and everything this is really cool actually i i haven't known that and of course the elvich station does look like in the tomb raider games just imagine so dear actors oh oh boo bangle boo bangle tina stop it please i'm not comfortable with that vera you, you're wearing such a tight suit i mean I couldn't help it. Yeah, but your boobs actually made made me forget what I wanted to say before. Ah, yeah, you know, like the like the filmmakers have to tell the actors how to get to the films. Like, yeah, then you have to solve this time puzzle and jump over the pit, and yeah, then you swim through the sewer water, and yeah, then you're here actually. <laughs> Just imagine it uh, would be like that. <laughs> Gross. Gross. Okay, and now, now I think I have to drop down this pit right here, and, uh, whoa, that light is, holy crap, really yellow, like some Simpsons lightning, uh, light bulb. Ah, and this is the door that we have opened before. Oh, come on, Lara. One, two, oh, come on, grab it, why won't you grab it? You're close enough already, aren't you? Okay. Um. Ah, yes. Press it. Whoa, what the? Why the hell was the earth rumbling like that? Holy crap. That was pretty awkward, actually. Lara, look, look, look what you've caused again. You caused like an earthquake just because you press the switch. God, where the hell am I right now? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Important, important. Gonna grab my MP5. And now, as soon as you step into this room, there's gonna be a chef come running out of one of those entrances. Do not shoot him if you want the fifth secret. Do not shoot him. Follow him. And kill him and one of his mates. His One of his mates actually opened a door. I think it's this one right here. And there you actually find two switches. Um, this switch right here opens the door to the fifth secret and this one right here let me see and uh, this one are, yeah this one right here opens those doors again so that you can after grabbing the fifth, fifth secret you can actually get back um yeah to the end of the level because guys everyone who doesn't care about the fifth secret over here like right down here is 
the end of the level. So yeah, if you don't care about the secret, go down there, drop into the hole and enjoy the cutscene is coming up because uh, the fifth secret means a lot of backtracking. I already do, I don't feel I'm the I don't look forward to doing it, but yeah, I want to get it as you know. Yeah, just save for a second and yeah. Let's go back to and grab the fifth secret. You will probably recognize a lot of rooms that we have because I've been through them already. No, oh, come on. Come on. I actually hate even Lara does that when she never grabs a ledge or something like that. Oh, come on, Lara. I'm losing my patience with you. Thank you. Uh, yeah. Am I even going the right way? I hope I am. Ah. Uh, hold on a sec. I'm really confused right now. Uh, wait, I just need to look something up. Just a minute. Alright, I'm back. Yeah, apparently I'm going the right way. I'm glad about that. Um, you know, there is... Oh, damn. <laughs> Not back there, Lyra. Over here, actually. Yeah, I, I actually... <laughs> Paused the recording before and went to watch the walkthrough again because getting the fifth secret actually really confuses me. I don't know. Woo! Okay. But yeah, like I said, we will get to see um, a lot of locations that we have seen before already or that we've been at already. Ooh, it's a tube! Oh, too bad you can't ride it, Lara. But I have a ticket, I could ride it. Yeah, but you already wasted it. Um. Uh, no. Yes, over here. Yeah, and actually we've been here already, guys. This is the pit where we almost get, got run over by the tube before. <laughs> and yes, we need to return to this room. Just imagine. Ugh. Hmm. Roxanne, you don't have to turn on the red light. Walk the streets for money. Why am I singing that? Guess because the room is red? Oh, Lara, you're such a Sherlock Holmes, seriously. Uh, I hate backtracking. Woo! And now we have to go get over here again. And, 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 <laughs> finally, this is the fifth secret. And it's the fifth secret is actually being observed or whatever. It has a Jeff security guard in it, but yeah, of course, those guys are never a problem for us. Ooh, boobs. And yeah, we actually find quite a few items in here. Also, uh, I think also the dead Jeff leaves us something. Hold on. Okay, yes, map pack and rockets. They actually give us quite a few rockets in this level, huh? Okay, and now it means backtracking. Um... Where, where where did I come from again? Oh, that's wrong. Where the hell did I come from? Holy crap. Are you serious? Uh, oh, wait. Ha. Huh. I th think... Yeah, it's over here. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh man, I'm, I'm, I'm a really confused person sometimes. And now we actually have to... Um, um, monkey swing again back to that part where the drill is. Yes. We have to go all the way back. Isn't that fun? I mean, we, 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 could, we couldn't have cared about that fifth secret. And just went down the hole and finished this pain of a level. But no. Tina of Rutter, of course, has to grab it. Uh? And why can't we suddenly on the w uh, walk on the drill again right now? Because... The last time we actually had to take this long route back. I still haven't figured out why though. Can someone tell me, maybe? If someone is even still watching the video, I mean, it's gonna be quite a long video, I think. How long am I even recording already? 
I don't even know. Half an hour, maybe? <laughs> so yeah, I already thank everyone who has been watching the whole thing. Um, until now. And, and now? Is this... Ah, yeah. Drop down here again. Yes. Oh my gosh, we're so close to the end of the level. I can almost sense it. Or taste it. Hmm. Ah, yeah. The infamous door of doom. <laughs> okay, Larry, this time you will behave. Oh, come on, please. Ah, thank you. Thank you for being cooperative. Whoa! Oh, why the hell is the earth rumbling like this? I seriously don't get it. But you know what? I won't question it anymore because I'm close to the end of the level. Just... Are we already there, actually? Please, please, please. Please, yes. Oh, yes, we are. Guys, this is the end of the level. Let's grab this mech kit. And then I would say thank you very, very much for watching. Enjoy the cutscene that is coming up. And yeah, I would say I will see you in the next level, which is Lutzgate. But yeah, Lara, now you have to take quite a drop. I hope your boobs will save you. Of course they will. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Cheers, guys. So, you must be after Miss Lee then. Business, not pleasure. Though obviously not for revenge, man. You've hardly got the face for that. And you have? <laughs> How moronic a question is that, eh? I don't even have a face, man. I came down here looking for work. And what do I get, eh? But Miss Lee's cosmetic company and her lab assistant job. No experience necessary. Good wage. Accommodation with it. Aye. Locked in a flotation tank for days on end, in some fetid syrup. And when we come out, cause lots of us applied like, no face or fleck, man. And a boot and doing the waste disposal shoot here. Presumed deed. Some kind of failed experiment then. Oh, ta, very much. But I, and for added insult, when I tried to take my own life, I found it just didn't work. You mean Sophia's testing some sort of immortality power? Along with her own brand of facelift. Why aye, man. Everlasting beauty. She's obviously not fully worked it out yet, but she takes the best results for herself. See, I don't care what your business with her is. You can't be any more shiftless than what she is. So I'm going to go out of my way to help you. That is, after you've done something for us here, like. Very generous of you. What do you want? A bottle of that mummy preservation stuff from the Natural History Museum. Embalming fluid? Aye, for rotten flesh you can't whack it, man. The museum's pretty interesting, I'm told. You'll like it. So why don't you go yourself? One of them Egyptian lassies there is a bit pissed off, like that uh, she didn't get immortality the way she wanted it. And seeing as we've done better than her in that department, I didn't care to imagine what curse we could get given any worse than what we've got already, like. You'll be fine, though, pet. You die easily. Thanks. <laughs>